Hello everybody, welcome back here to Pete's Corner. We saw this first time uh, at NAMM, I think it was 2018, the beginning of 2018, where the guys had brought it with them, they had it on the stand. Uh, I didn't get a chance to try it, um, so I'm very excited about plugging this in today. And I've, ha I've had this pedal today, I've plugged it in today, and I, I really, really like it. They've really, really done a good job. So you've probably heard uh, or seen the, the big Revival Drive. They came out in two different versions, had a little pedal in the front there, loads of features on the front here and on the top with EQ, and you could do all sorts of things with it, like groundbreaking stuff that you could make your amp sound like old Fender amps and Master amps and that. They really went into to details and that. Uh, so now they brought out the compact version of it. Uh, it's the same size as the Cali 76, so you know, if you know the Cali 76, that is the size. And of course, everything that the guys at Origin FX they make are absolutely top quality. Everything inside, everything on the outside. Um, and what you heard there in the beginning uh, was just me jamming around with a little loop of pedal from Boss on the floor there for a little loop and then just tweaking some stuff here with the Hanson. Um, I'm plugged into a Victory V140 Deluxe and I'm running everything on 12 o'clock over there and a little bit of reverb and the mid kick is in the middle. So it's kind of, it's on, it's, everything is at 12 o'clock as you can be uh, because I want to kind of demonstrate how uh, the features of this pedal work. Okay, so if we take a look at the top here, we can set everything on 12 to make it look nice and neat. Um, you've got an output, you've got highs, you've got gain, you've got a dry to overdrive, so like it's a blend, which blends the dry signal with the overdrive signal. And then you've got the more and the presence here on the top, which kind of um, sort of determines the, the characteristics of the uh, break off in the power state of the distortion. Um, and then down here, you've got uh, some post drive EQ controls. You've got a P amp, so if you flick it up into position one, which I'm going to do a bit later, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use the capsules and I'm going to try to run this straight into capsules, straight into the DI stick so you can hear it sound like. So you can basically use this as just a, a, a preamp pedal. So if you flick down to EQ1 here, uh, that is an EQ setting for brighter amps. And if you flick down to number two, EQ2, that is for darker sounding amps. And then you've got the adjustment control over here, which you can then uh, fine tune those kind of frequencies. Uh, for your so so you get a good sound for your amp. Now enough talk. I think we should just let the pedal uh, play for itself. So if we, for instance, have a clean tone here with the Hanson, that's a nice simple clean. Okay, so if I start with this uh, the little preamp setting, see now I'm on the dry signal. You get the dry signal all the way through. So. When I flick that switch, nothing happens. So you then notice if I turned over to the OD overdrive setting here, and I flick the switch. To the preamp, which we need the capsules for. So you, you choose the one that matches your amp best. Maybe. So I'll say I'll say EQ two, and then the adjustment is kind of sort of three o'clock, maybe three thirty. I mean, already there, it just sounds great. <laughs> it's like, it just sounds wicked. So, if you then start uh, dialing up the, uh, let's let's just go, let's start from the top. So your output there. So let's say we're all the way. You can you can use kind of as a as a as a boost thing.
just as a clean, it just boosts up the signal. And if you add in some highs in there, So let's dial it over to the overdrive side and try to some the highs and the lows and the more and present. This is great. Turn down the gain. Bring in some gain, take some OD down. Now let's dial in a little bit of the overdrive signal. Just so we get a nice crunchy tone. Then all the way up for the overdrive. It just sounds great with everything on 12 o'clock. Let's see what happens when I take the highs down. So the uh, lows down. I'm a sucker for those lows. Let's set everything back at 12 here and let's try this more. Let's dial it. Let's see what happens when we just everything at 12 there again. Take it back. Oh, yeah, it's definitely more saturated. <laughs> Let's try to put some lows in that. Ooh, hey, remember that setting and we see that camera up there. Remember that setting because that is one good setting. Okay, so that is a really, really cool sound here, like proper. So let's quickly just try that with some single chords here. So here we go. Let's 
Let's try some humbugger. No humbug in the back. Well, absolutely nothing wrong with that. So let's walk back to the guitar we used in the beginning so we know kind of what the tone is like. All right then, back to the Hanson guitar. There we are. And uh, so let's just see what happens when I dial in the more. So it gets that sort of uh, more rounder sound. And a higher there, so you could probably take some. Man, it sounds good. It sounds great. It really sounds great. Should we try the PRS really quick? Right, so here we go, back pick on the PRS. <laughs> That's the humbugger, so here's a split. Up non split.
great. Um, I might have to put this on my pedal board. Well, I don't say that very often. Uh, I've got a Supro delay on the floor, by the way, so uh, just in case anyone was wondering where the delay came from. All right, guys, uh, Origin Effects um, Revival Drive. It's difficult for me to say because I'm Danish, uh, but absolutely sound. Sounds great. Go and check it out. I will put a link in uh, the description for the Andersons website where you can go and purchase set pedal. Um, and I am going to plug the capsules in now and take you through some tones on the outro. So thank you very much for watching. What you're going to hear next is the Revival Drive Compact in the preamp mode into a capsules mono. Tiny little capsules thing there, straight into the Apollo from Universal Audio. And uh, thank you very much for watching. I am Pete, and I'll see you very soon. Take care, guys.